With Americans being advised to stay home, online engagement in the U.S. has increased dramatically. And one of the most common at-home media activities last month was gaming. Local 5's Calvin Lewis shows us how games and non-gamers alike are uniting on the virtual front. It's engaging, you know, not only if you're just playing online, but there's plenty of content that's got great story and a lot of um, emotional engagement. Online competitive gaming, or eSports, has seen a recent frenzy of traffic. Between March 12th and March 19th, online gaming traffic in the U.S. surged by 75%. Not only PC, but you have Xbox, Nintendo, and PlayStation that you have people uh, playing online. And they've had some issues with their servers uh, recently because of how many people are on. While they've had to temporarily close their doors, Edge VR Arcade has seen a lot of their customers and community move online. One of the many attractions they offer is the sense of escape through gaming. You can take an interactive uh, role in everything, whether you're role playing a person online that's a character that you created up, or if you're playing a single player game that has an engaging story that allows you to make decisions that affect the outcome of the ending or create a lot of circumstances that you have to work through. And even though playing online requires a headset, it still has that same feeling as if you're playing alongside someone in the same room. I've played Rocket League for about four years now, and uh, I have a friend here in, in Green Bay that we're teammates, and then we met a third teammate who is French, and he lives in Canada. Last year, he came to visit us for a couple weeks because we had become such good friends, and it's like that's a connection that we'd never be able to have without online gaming. It's really a testament to interconnectivity that you can get through online gaming in the world and the relationships that you can create. Which is opening new paths in the virtual world. Kind of a new era trying to show the possibilities that eSports can have, uh, which is just keeps growing and growing every day. In Green Bay, Calvin Lewis, Local 5 News. Thank you, Calvin. Well, despite their doors being closed at this time, Edge VR says they are still able to engage their community online thanks to some online tournaments.